head and they be like, we hear this shit and be like, What's his name? Ronald. Hi. Hola. Dile hola. This your this your little guy? Yeah, yeah. this is a little guy. He's got he's got the, he's got the same chain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same turn around, turn around, buddy. Turn, turn around. around. Turn around. Turn around. Look at the camera. Show your chain. He's got, he's got, he's got a mini daddy chain. Wow. Man. You're blinging. I didn't believe in you. You lost again and again and again. The lights are cut off. But you're still looking at your dream, reviewing it every day and saying to yourself, it's not over until I... MLB fan got a moment of a lifetime. He got an opportunity to play in the Major League Baseball Celebrity All-Star Game, and he got a big league hit. He was chosen to play from MLB moments, but he got a true experience of a lifetime in baseball as he was called out when he was clearly safe. He's like, I didn't get tagged. He didn't tag me, but you know what? They didn't have replay review in this game, so he got a full Major League Baseball experience getting called out. When he was clearly safe, oh my goodness. <sighs> Pat me to black him out. You play baseball? Yeah. You like the Woo Sox? Yeah. You ever been to a game? Yeah, I have. Yeah? Do you know uh, Ryan Fitzgerald? Yeah. That's me. It is? Yeah, you want to bat? Yeah. Alright. I saw you swinging out here. I was like, oh man. Six four two ten and looking like a supermodel. That's Joe Hale Tony, folks. I look a shot to me, ya tiene razón. Yo a romper el corazón, a romper el corazón. A strike and an out away from a natty. Two outs, runner at first. The 0 2 pitch. Swing! One gone. Ben Rooker at the plate. Here's a check for the third. Rally from his knee. He's a oh, double play. Rally. How about your brains, oh, teammates, Ozzy? That's also oh, Rally all easy. day long. Oh, we'll take that, Josh. <laughs> hey, baby. Come on, baby. Wow. Austin Riley makes the grab and then from a knee across the diamond between the microphones and a double play. Canel went from being banned from baseball and under government surveillance to pitching in the Major League Baseball All-Star Game. Canel played three seasons of pro ball in Cuba before deciding to leave the country. Instead of illegally defecting, like most Cuban-born players do to play in America, Cano went the legal route and applied to the government. During his application, Cano was banned from playing or training in Cuba and was under 24-hour government surveillance for an entire year. Eventually, he was allowed to move to Argentina, then to the Dominican Republic, where he was signed by the Twins in 2019. He made the Major Leagues in 2022 as a 28-year-old, 
where he was traded midseason to the Orioles and ended the year with an 11.5 ERA. He began 2023 in the minor leagues, but after his call up in early April, retired the first 24 hitters he faced in Orioles franchise record. His efforts were rewarded with an All-Star Game appearance, where he racked up a pair of strikeouts, as a 29-year-old is now one of the best pitchers in the sport he was once banned from playing. I am the on-field operations coordinator at the New York Mets, and this is a day in the life. I start my day meeting with our team and assembling the game logs for the night. From there, we have our pre-production meeting and go over all the details, and then I distribute all of the game logs to our control room staff. From there, we meet the national anthem singer and execute our sound check on the field. Then we bring in our veteran of the game honoree with their families. Then I head out to the field to execute the pregame ceremonies. I put on my headset to talk to the control room, and then we execute our season ticket member of the game, first pitch, national anthem, and our kids take the field. It's a lot of running back and forth, but it's a lot of fun. Every day is different at City Field. Then I have to reel all the kids back in safely, and that's a full pregame ceremony. Next up, we have our veteran of the game that goes live at the end of the third inning. This is where we recognize our honoree's service to our country. At the end of the day, I put my headset and gear back away and get ready to do it all again tomorrow.